पंजाब केसरी नवोदय टाइम्स में आज की हमारी खास मेहमान है फेमिना मिस इंडिया वर्ल्ड 2022 द ब्यूटीफुल एंड ग्रेसफुल सिनी शेट्टी जो कि 71st मिस वर्ल्ड ग्रैंड फिनाले में इंडिया को रिप्रेजेंट करने के लिए पूरी तरह से तैयार है नाउ व्हाइल द होल नेशन इज रूटिंग फॉर हर सिनी इज हियर टू टॉक अबाउट हर लेवल ऑफ प्रिपरेशन लेवल ऑफ एक्साइटमेंट एंड नर्वसनेस इफ एनी एंड मच मोर तो ढेर सारी बातें इनसे हम करेंगे बट सबसे पहले अ वार्म 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 वेलकम टू यू सिनी ऑन आवर प्लेटफार्म Thank you so much, Nidhi. How are you today? I'm great, and uh, you know, as I said, the whole country is rooting for you. So fingers crossed. But let's start this interview with uh, positive affirmations. ऐसे ही मान के चलते हैं कि ये interview हम 9th March के बाद कर रहे हैं. आप जीत चुकी हैं Miss World, और मैं आपको congratulate कर रही हूँ और आप thank you speech दे रही हैं. Oh God. Uh, well, thank you so much for every for everyone's support. Thank you so much for every effort that everyone has put in. Thank you, God, for being so kind. Um, I know that this is a big responsibility. It's the Miss World crown, and I hope I render to every responsibility. Thank you to my nation for supporting me and giving me that platform, for making me the one to represent your country. I hope I do not make India, but also the entire world proud. Now, amen, amen. Or एक वो वो जो वे वो तो आपका वो भी वो भी कर दीजिए. बस अब हमने platform set कर दिया है for your victory. <laughs> I hope, I hope that should. Yes, uh, we've sent it out to the universe. You are manifesting it. it. The whole country it. Yes, अब वो मैनिफेस्ट कर लिया पॉजिटिव एफर्मेशन हमने दे दी हैं तो लेट्स जस्ट थिंक पॉजिटिव हाँ रिप्रेजेंटिंग वन पॉइंट फोर बिलियन पीपल नॉट एन इजी टास्क आई डू अग्री आई डू अग्री एंड ऑल्सो द फैक्ट दैट इट्स इट्स द फीलिंग ऑफ वन पॉइंट फोर बिलियन पीपल अलॉन्ग विद द कल्चर अलॉन्ग विद ट्रेडिशन अलॉन्ग विद डिफरेंट हाईलाइट दैट वी गेट to our life because india is a diverse country i like to say that every 2 kilometers that we walk it feels that we have entered a new nation altogether right different dialect different people uh, different traditions different cultures different geographical locations at the same time so not only representing india but the fact that i get to host miss world organization to our country i want to make sure that i show them every aspect of india right from its art and culture to its delicious food to uh, what is in india you know we are uh, when we talk about our geographical locations we know that uh, we have the best of the best mountains we have the best of the best beaches and uh, uh, water locations we have the best of the best uh, cultural aspects to show so i think i want to live up to the entire expectation of it uh and um, show that india is a potluck of culture and uh, a divine land <laughs> correct correct and may you succeed in showing uh, the other delegates that but tell me something ki ek to hota hai ki aap as a delegate ja rahe ho participate karne kisi bhi pageant mein wo ek pressure hota hai dusra hai to be the host delegate so is your pressure double on your shoulders right now I think uh, there's a lot more excitement. I do not feel there's any pressure at the moment, but uh, I'm excited for all the girls to come. They're coming in. Most of them are coming to India for the first time. Uh, like I said, there's so much to show in India. There is so much to show, and I'm also living up to the old Indian saying, "Atiti Devo Bhava." The guest is our god. Uh, we we are all gonna live here under one roof as one family, and. Uh, I know that I've always told that that I am a text away, I am a call away. You let me know. So I hope that I live up to the Indian uh, hospitality standards. Correct. Yeah. But you know, just say इतना बड़ा इतना diverse uh, culture wise, जैसे आपने कहा हमारा uh, you know देश है और बहुत सारी चीजों में हम अलग हो जाते हैं जैसे ना आप इस state के हैं मैं इस state की हूँ आप इस city के हैं मैं इस city की हूँ लेकिन कुछ चीजें हैं जो हमको unite कर देती हैं जैसे cricket एक चीज है जो हमें unite करती है हमारा cinema है जो हमें unite करता है ना of course इस तरह के international global platform पे जो pageants होते हैं तो अब कोई ये नहीं कहेगा कि यार हम क्योंकि सिनी इस स्टेट की है इसलिए हम इनको रूट कर रहे हैं हम सब मिलकर ये कह रहे हैं 1.4 बिलियन प्लस कि हम क्योंकि ये इंडिया की डेलीगेट हैं इसलिए इनके लिए रूट कर रहे हैं सो विद ऑल दैट लव एंड वॉम हाउ इलेक्टेड डू यू फील आई एम सो सॉरी योर वॉइस वेंट एंड आई कुडेंट हियर द लास्ट लाइन 
तो मैं वही कह रही थी कि इतना प्यार जो आपको इतनी सारी जनता से मिल रहा है हाउ रिलेटेड डज दैट मेक यू फील सुपर रिलेटेड आई लाइक आई सेड यू नो इफ व्हेन आई विन व्हेन यू आस्क मी माय विनिंग स्पीच माय फर्स्ट थैंक्स गोस टू ऑल माय सपोर्टर्स इंडिया एक और चीज के लिए भी मशहूर है टू गिविंग ब्यूटी क्वींस टू द वर्ल्ड क्योंकि इसके पहले भी अगर हम मिस यूनिवर्स की बात कर ले मिस वर्ल्ड की बात कर ले सो बिफोर यू यू नो जो प्रोडसेसर्स रहे हैं इज देयर अ रोल मॉडल जिसको आप फॉलो करके अपनी लाइफ या अपनी जर्नी को जा रही हैं या सीनी इज अ यूनिक इंडिविजुअल इन हरसेल्फ I think a combination of everything. When I say that, like you said, India has given birth to some spectacular beauty queens. The legacy that I get to live is a dream. Name anyone: Priyanka Chopra, Ishwarya Rai, Diana Hayden, Manushi Chiller. I think all of them have given the world a uh, a lot to look up to. But if you ask me one name, I would definitely go with Priyanka Chopra. I feel that. I relate to her on a lot of levels. I am a unique individual, but at the same time, when I have to look up to someone, I see all the good work, the good deeds, uh, the fierceness that comes out of her, the sheerness that comes out of her, that inspires me more to do better in my own true self. Uh, I I do agree that she is not afraid to voice her opinion, and that's what I relate the most to. करेक्ट करेक्ट बट यू नो ये जो जर्नी है एक तो काफी इंतजार आपको करना पड़ा फाइनली यू नो ग्रैंड फिनाले के लिए सो ये जो वेट पीरियड रहा है सिनी इसमें किस तरह से आपने अपनी प्रेप को और ज्यादा इनहांस किया क्योंकि ये सिर्फ प्रेप लुकिंग गुड एंड फीलिंग गुड के बारे में नहीं है इट इज ऑल्सो अबाउट अ लॉर्ड ऑफ अदर थिंग्स इज अल्बिनेशन ऑफ मेनी मोर थिंग्स Yes. So uh, like I say the worth has been weight. Uh, the worth uh, the weight weight has been worth it. I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm going to take this again. Yeah. Like I said the wait has been worth it uh because the last two years I've been prepping for this very moment uh Miss World in it is a beautiful platform I feel that Miss World is one of the most unique platforms because it's not just a beauty contest in the last two years I've been working on my walk my talk my communication skills um like any other beauty contest would I was working on my makeup my hair my styling but along with that came a vision a purpose that i was working on there was always a chance to better myself better myself as a personality better myself as a mindset better myself as a representation of 1.4 billion people and i was also working on my beauty with a purpose project so the two year span had given me so much experience so much exposure that i'm here today ready to represent india with all my heart all my soul and india is ready here with all its heart and soul to root for you <laughs> and to you know see you wear that crown uh, but you know jab hum beauty pageants ki baat karte hain to ek zamana tha jab you know people would look down on it ki kya hai you know beauty pageant but aaj ki date mein especially agar hum uh, you know miss world ki baat karte hain it is not just a beauty pageant it is beauty with a purpose so what is your take on uh, this initiative beauty with purpose <laughs> like i said for me miss world as a platform is very beautiful a very unique platform platform um to give you an overview miss world is one of the most largest and the oldest pageants in the history of pageants and uh, the soul the uh, foundation of miss world is this beautiful initiative called beauty with a purpose project and to put some highlight on it every girl from her country who represents her country buckets out a project with a socially relevant issue in her country mm-hmm. and all these 120 girls come under one roof on one platform and we all discuss these issues now imagine me sitting here in india i know about what's happening in turkey what's happening in a different part of the globe that i would have never visited that i would have never known and we all discuss the accessibility we all discuss uh, the help that we can give each other sometimes a social media reach like one story can help people across the globe in the world of social media and that's the beauty of beauty with a purpose and i get so, to so live so aapka jo initiative hai uh, ya jo project hai aashaaye ye ye kiske bare mein hai well uh, my beauty with a purpose project is called aashaaye which means ray of hope uh 
Let me take you back to the days of your school when you were pursuing education. I'm sure a lot of people around the world would also relate. There was always a race to complete the syllabus. True. Race to, uh, you know, just learn and mug up answers and understand uh, whatever's happening in that particular syllabus without a sub just the subjective comprehension and move ahead in life. Hmm. But when you enter a professional setup, you know that what is personality development? And ye itna sab kuch sikha, usko apply kaise karu life mein. Right. That's when you realize that. And when you research kids across India, you realize that a lot of people enroll in government-aided schools or private schools, but the conversion rate is so low. When you again find the reason, there's a gap between education and employment, and that is soft skills personality development, public speaking, the way you conduct yourself in interview. We bucket that under soft skills. Right. And that's been the vision and purpose of my life because as an individual, I know how important education is for me, how important employment has been to shape me who I am today. The amount of, uh, the foundation of me. Hello? Yeah. Oh, I thought blanked out. Okay. The foundation of me has been education and employment. Uh, but at the same time, to elevate myself, that soft corner for soft skills has always been there. Um, and uh, when I look at my project, I feel that it's very fulfilling because a, not a lot of light has been put on soft skills, public speaking mm. as a topic. Right. I have te teamed up with Teach India, it's the Times Initiative, which addresses knowledge and prepares young adults for employment and job. I've also partnered with a number of NGOs, namely uh, SPID, Sarthi, Pahel, Parivartan, Shil, Sansthan, a lot more NGOs as well. Um, in the course of nine months, we have been able to cater to 12 batches with 30 students each. Um, and I hope that in months coming, it totally increases. Um, we have also come up with a three-month curriculum, uh, which focuses on public speaking, spoken in development under the British Council curriculum, uh, which caters to mm -hmm. such students who are a part of our program. Uh, and this journey has been very fulfilling. And all thanks to Miss India Organization, Miss World Organization, and the entire initiative of Beauty with a Purpose, because there was something in me that I could give out to the world, and I channeled it through my project. Right. And I think it's it's very beautiful because at the end of the day, communication is the king. Or if you communicate, you can do it. You can do it. So there is no stopping you from winning the world. But Sini, when you are in the Miss World journey, ke baat kar rahe hai, there must have been a journey before that also. So I want to know a little bit about it. From a corporate girl to a pageant winner, how did it happen? Within a blink of a second, I mean, <laughs> that's all I say. I like to say that I won in the year 2022. And uh, I've lived two different lives in the same year. Like you said, okay. I was a corporate girl pursuing accountancy, working in the field of marketing, loved dancing, always figured out that dancing through the life has to be your motto. Cut to when Miss India happened and on the night of 3rd July, I was Miss India with a new vision, with a new purpose to life. The change has been... I cannot describe what my life has turned out to be in a very positive way um, the way that I have been able to cater to my caliber my capabilities with the platform that I've gotten uh, and the swift that every experience that has uh, taught me right from learning accountancy to dance has catered to my personality to become Miss India today so the journey has been beautiful. But you and, know, in uh, India, conditioning hoti hai, right? India, mein jo conditioning hamari hoti hai, hamare, uh, family ki taraf se ki achhi education lelo, phir achhi job mil jaye, aur baaki chizein as a hobby pursue karo to chalta hai. So, uh, aapki family mein ye jo aapka shift hua profession ka, industry ka, career ka, how well did your parents take it? Because ek established career se aapne ek aisi taraf shift kiya which is still you know hoga nahi hoga so uh you know when parents worry about that i do not blame them 
because it's only human to worry about someone you care so when my parents questioned me when there was worry from their end uh, which was very uh, obvious and there was a lot of understanding from my end hmm. where i made them sit and understand that this is a route that i want to pursue this is the direction that i want to go and there's logic behind it and that logic i explained to them in a very calm manner and they understood it they understood that this is the direction that she wants in life this is what she ma- what it makes her happy this is something that if she pursues she will grow in life and uh, i like to say one thing which i've learned from my mentor that life mein koi gile shikwe nahi hone chahiye there should be no regrets in life and i knew that there would be a lot of regret that would have happened if i would have passed on this opportunity and i'm so right. glad i passed on this journey and my parents today are my biggest supporters they are my backbone i hope i make them proud on the miss world stage and uh, yes from that day i think that one conversation has changed the entire looking and direction of my life even from their perspective बहुत सारी यंग गर्ल्स हैं हु वुड लुक अप टू यू एज देर इंस्पिरेशन क्योंकि ऐसा नहीं है कि आप सडनली मिस इंडिया बन के फिर यू नो आप मिस वर्ल्ड में जा रहे हो इसके पहले भी आपकी एक डांस की जर्नी रही है जो आपने यू नो डिजिटली भी आगे उसको काफी लेके गए हो आपने सिखाया भी है वॉट वुड बी योर मैसेज टू गर्ल्स हु वुड अस्पायर टू फॉलो योर फुट स्टेप्स डोंट बी अफ्रीड टू बी टू एम्बिशियस नथिंग इन द वर्ल्ड इज नॉट पॉसिबल like they say the sky is the limit and if any day anyone has associated you negatively with being ambitious will do not listen to them a mirror and your confidence goes a long way stand in front of the mirror and just say that you can do it manifest it your whole way and never look down on yourself you know right. very very so you've put it very beautifully and very rightly um but lastly let's put a hypothetical question i'm sure you're going to when every other delegate is coming to it right but let's say a question is asked what makes you different and what makes you as a winner in your mind sini what would your answer be uh well i wouldn't like to give out the actual answer that is there <laughs> yeah yeah please don't i want you to have some surprises at the contest i would want you to follow my journey i personally feel that uh, my personality uh, my authenticity also the values of a modern woman from india who is also traditionally uh, connected to her roots in india someone who understands the value of hospitality humility uh, her service not only towards herself but to the world is something that sets me apart from everyone i'm also someone who represents a set of a pragmatic generation the generation z so there's a lot of understanding that comes within for the world for the crown and for the generations to come along wow uh ye answer jo aapne abhi diya jab yahi aisa hai ki is pe agar main judge hoti main to aapko crown pehna deti i'm sure your actual answer is going to be something just ko sab log bahut zyada impressed honge so on that note wishing you all the good luck on behalf of the entire nation and positive affirmations once again you are miss world for us already thank you so much it's all the love and blessings that you give us thank you good luck